Hello everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel Learn GCP with Mahesh. Today we'll explore the case studies related to GCP's Professional Cloud Architect certification. There are three case studies. If you scroll down, there are three case studies which is important from the exam perspective: Mount Creek Games, Rust for Win, Theram Earths. So I have opened the links for those things. So these three case studies are very important from the exam perspective. What I have done is to make easy for you to prepare for the certification. I have created a cheat sheet. This is a cheat sheet which I have created, which will help you to prepare for the exam very easily. So I have categorized it by industry, the current environment. What is the migration approach? What kind of compute you should use? Storage and database related stuff, big data and the proposed architecture. So if you quickly see Mount Creek is a gaming company who wants to build scalable highly scalable gaming applications on cloud they were previously on another cloud similarly trust for when is an e-commerce website they are currently on on-premise scalability is an issue for them and they want to move to cloud there is a heavy manif heavy equipment manufacturing organization they don't have as such any issues the only problem which they have is downtime they want to reduce the downtime from four weeks to one week and based on the case study, I have created these compute storage options, the mappings, uh, which can be used in GCP, which should really help you. For Mount Creek Games, the gaming uh, company, this architecture, this architecture should help you to understand how they are planning to do. So the streaming data gets pushed to PubSub. From there, data flow comes into picture to handle the stream streaming data and the next data would be pushed to BigQuery where it can do analytics and visualize it on a specific BI tool. And any logs which is sent from uh, log information which is sent from users gets uploaded to Google Cloud Storage. And this is a batch processing. And again, data flow comes into picture. And for Theram Earths, this architecture suits very well where you have uh, devices. In this case, it's tractors, bulldozers, all those stuffs where they connect to IoT core and from there the machine the data is pushed to PubSub and the same flow follows which we had seen in the uh, gaming architecture where it, the data is pushed to data flow processing uh, like transformation happens enrichment happens there then if you want to visualize or create reports you can use BigQuery Big Table is not required in that use case so that's all about uh, the Google's Professional Cloud Architect certification case studies. Hope the video was helpful. Thanks for watching.